Hey everybody, Patrick from One Shot Killing Media here, and today we're going to be going over the Vortex Spitfire 3X. Uh, already did a video on the features and so on, so pretty much today we're just going to do a little bit of a run through, range testing. Uh, we'll shoot a quick group here just to see where we're at, and then from there I'll give you a GoPro view, we'll shoot some steel, and just give you an idea of how the optic works. So here we go, let's get ready. So if we take a look at the grouping itself, you can see that we're pretty much right on top of each other. One of the things to keep in mind here is that this isn't a steady target base. It actually wobbles side to side, so you can get quite a bit of play. But everything's about where I want it to be just for shooting steel and everything today. So let's go ahead, and next what we're going to do is go ahead and show you what it looks like shooting this through the GoPro. So let's go ahead and get started. Hit on steel. Another hit. And another hit. So, as you can see, shooting through the vortex prism, we are getting hits on steel. All right. Hey, everybody. Let's keep Patrick with One Shot Killer Media here, and again, we're working today with the Vortex Spitfire 3X Prism Scope. Uh, just going to shoot a little bit of steel here quick, and we'll put it through a couple little random tests here just to see if anything really throws it off. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so we've got our first hit. I'm going to go ahead and uh, give it a drop, see if that throws off the zero at all. Let's go ahead, give her another try here. Another hit. All right, Let's see if we can uh, remove the scope. And let's go ahead and see if that does anything to it. Put it back on and see if we still have a zero here. And we're just hand tightening these here. All right, so let's go ahead, see if we can still hit our target. I'm gonna go again for the far target here. There so we go, that's see, another hit. Even after a drop, after a kick, uh, we still are staying on target here with the Vortex Prism Spitfire. All right, everybody, so, like in some of the other tests that I've done and that you've seen, I'm going to go ahead and uh, we'll slam the uh, vortex prism here up against the, uh, the actual door jam. So we'll see if that throws off the zero or anything along those lines. We'll go ahead and uh, give it a try here. Here we go. Okay, give it one more time for good measure. All right. The housing's holding up pretty good. Nothing too crazy as far as scratching your blemishes or anything, so that's good. Let's go ahead and uh, get back on our targets over here. And my target is going to be, let's take a look here. We'll be shooting for the, the longer target, which is going to be right at my fingertip here. There we go. So let's go ahead and give that a shot, and we'll see how the Spitfire held up. Alright, we got a hit. Overall, uh, with a little bit of a range review here, I can't complain. The Spitfire uh, 3X Prism Scope by Vortex has held up quite well. They do have a uh, lifetime warranty on their products also, which is nice. Uh, everything held up nicely through the testing that I did, from you know running up against the door jam, to taking it off, to taking it off and kicking it. Uh, so, dropping it too uh, was all handled here pretty well by the actual scope so kept the rifle on target and uh, yeah other than that I can't really comment on much else but everything worked the way that I thought it close. should. You can see a couple little dings and dents uh, one on the scope cap here 
you know, a little bit of scrapes there, a little bit of dirt from being on the ground, but overall held up nice and uh, I think you're looking at a pretty good product. All here. right, there we go. So if you have any questions or anything like that, feel free to let me know in the comments section. Uh, you know, again, check us out, like us on Facebook, subscribe on our YouTube channel, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I always have different uh, gun pictures, videos, uh, talk, everything like that coming up. So just let me know what you want to hear and what you want to see, and I'll make sure that I uh, talk with the manufacturers and get it in my hands. All right, have a great day, everybody.